What's going on everybody? It's Cody here from Tidewe. As you can tell, there's some snow on the ground here in Wisconsin. It is cold and I think it's like a bitter 15 degrees out right now. So I'm gonna try and make this quick, um, but we are talking about Tidewe's heated clothing today simply because it is cold outside and I just kind of want to walk you through some of the items that we have that can help you stay warm in the outdoors. But before we go ahead and do that, please go down and hit that subscribe button down below. We have a ton of awesome content, review videos, hunting content here um, that we post on our YouTube channel that we don't want you to miss. So if you're not already, hit that subscribe button down below, like this video, and uh, leave a comment down below. Let me know what your favorite piece of heated clothing from Tidewe is. So before we go ahead, I have a lineup of popular items of our heated clothing on the truck behind me here. I don't have everything here that is listed on our website because it, it would take me a long time to go through every little item. Um, but I do have a majority of the popular items uh, that you guys have seen a lot that has been purchased a lot in the past. And what I want to do is just kind of walk through those items, show you guys basically what they are and what they can be used for. Now, not every piece of heated clothing is going to come with this, but some of the items on our website, including this heated vest, will come with a lithium battery pack from Tidewe. Now, these these are just super simple little lithium battery packs that you can actually plug into the wall. You charge it just like you, you charge your cell phone basically. Um, and what it's going to have is a display on the front. And what that display is going to show you is basically the amount of charge that the battery has. So you can see that this display has 100 listed on there. Um, that's letting us know that this battery pack is actually charged in full and is ready to be used. Now that doesn't have to be fully charged to be used, obviously if you want to get the most runtime out of the, the heated clothing that you're wearing, um, you want that number to be at 100. On the heated vest, on the inside left side pocket here, you're going to have a USB cable. Now, all of our products are going to have a USB cable somewhere on the product. You'll just have to kind of search around for it, uh, read the instruction card that comes with the article of clothing to find this USB port. Once you've found it, all you're going to want to do is you're going to want to click the button on our battery pack here. That's gonna turn the battery pack on. You'll know it's on when you see that number illuminated there. And then all you're gonna do is plug the battery pack in to the vest, the jacket, uh, bibs, whatever we got here, and then tuck that away and you're good to go. So now you can come up here to the button. You can click and hold that. There we got red. It's a little tough to see because it's really bright out. I can go ahead and filter through the cycles. There's actually gonna be three heat settings on all of our heated products. These are all gonna be the same. They're all gonna heat the same. Um, red is gonna be your highest level. Red is going to heat your heated clothing up to 130 degrees. If you tap that button once, it'll illuminate white. And what white is gonna heat to is 115 degrees. And if you click it one more time, it's gonna be blue. Now blue is gonna bring you up to 100 degrees and obviously low is gonna give you the most runtime out of the battery. Um, kind of hovering around that eight to 10 hour mark. Medium's gonna get you um, in that five to six hour mark. And then obviously if you are running it on high, you're gonna get the least amount of runtime at three hours, which is actually still pretty good um, for heating up your clothing to 130 degrees. So these heated vests make a great undergarment um, for any type of outdoor work you're gonna be doing, hunting, fishing, um, at pretty much anything outdoors when it's cold. Uh, you can wear this vest either, either over a sweatshirt like I am right now. If it's really cold outside obviously I'm not gonna be outside right now for a duration of time um, but if I was gonna be fishing or hunting I might even just put a jacket over this vest and turn the vest on that jackets gonna kind of insulate the heat it's gonna keep the heat on the inside um, and it just makes a very great undergarment uh, for being out in the cold so if you're looking at a heated vest you can wear it like this you can also wear it as a base layer now again this is the camouflage design right here and like I was saying you're also gonna be able to get that in a black version now we do make make two separate vests. Uh, one is actually going to have a hood on the back of it. This one actually has the hood. Um, if I were to unzip it, the hood would pop up and that hood is actually heated as well. Uh, the other vest that we have is the one that I have on right now. This one does not have a hood. Um, it, however, does have a little neck warmer in the back right here that will actually heat up and heat the back of your neck as well. So two different styles of vests. They do essentially the same thing. Um, it's really just based on what you prefer and what you'd like to see in your heated clothing. So we have heated vests, again, great for a base layer or outer layer if you're gonna be spending some time out, outdoors in some mildly cold weather or even extreme cold temperatures. 
Now moving on from the heated vest, we'll go ahead and get into our heated bibs. This is just our gray pair of heated bibs. They also are available in camouflage, super fitting. They're actually extremely warm even without being heated, uh, but you're gonna have heating elements on both sides of your chest here. And then you're also gonna have heating elements in the back, kind of on your lower back section. I have found these bibs uh, to be great for fishing. I've found them to be great for any sorts of like yard work in the outdoors. I use them to cut wood a lot. Um, and especially on extremely cold days like it is today. Uh, they're super nice. Basically stay comfortable in that cold weather and uh, also get some heat on your body too as well. So again, yard work, fishing, maybe even you know some sporting events or anything like that that's gonna be happening in the cold. Uh, these bibs are definitely great for. Kind of moving right down the line of work clothing. We actually just came out with a new product from Tidewee about a month ago now. Uh, we're actually calling these our heated work jackets. And uh, what this is, is basically a Kevlar material on the outside that's super durable. It's gonna hold up um, you know, to, to strenuous activities, whether you're on the ground, maybe bending over a lot, cutting wood, um, you know, doing a lot of outdoor work, uh, this jacket's gonna be kind of the one that you want. Now, obviously, if you're doing work outside, you might not need the heating elements inside of the jacket, uh, but there are gonna be times where you do have to work in those extremely cold temperatures and having just a little boost uh, every now and then is gonna be super helpful. So again, you can turn the heating elements off whenever you want um, by simply just holding the button. So you can turn them on and off however you need to throughout the day to help keep you warm, give you those little boosts of heat to help keep you warm in the outdoors. So again, we have these available in this khaki color. We also have them available in black. Um, both of them feature that next camouflage pattern around the jacket too as well. But super awesome jacket. These things have been extremely popular uh, the last couple of weeks here. And uh, yeah, they'll help keep you warm in the outdoors. And real quick, before I put the work jacket down, uh, the little heating button for this jacket is gonna be located on the bottom left-hand side of the jacket. Moving right down the line with jackets, uh, we do have a soft fleece lined jacket. Uh, this would actually be great if you're gonna be doing any sort of hunting in the woods, uh, maybe mid season where it's really not that cold out yet. Um, it's just a little cold in the mornings. You want that little boost of heat. Uh, the material on the outside of this is going to be a fleece lined material that's gonna be extremely quiet out in the woods. So if you're looking to stay silent, uh, this might be the jacket for you. Another awesome jacket, this is available in black. It's also available in this camouflage pattern that you're seeing right here. Now, here is a product that we released last year with a new camo pattern. This is actually a veil camouflage pattern. This is the Evade pattern. Super, super popular for waterfall. These jackets have been an absolute hit over the past year and a half now since we released them. Super warm, uh, they're windproof, they're waterproof. Pretty much meant for those hardcore waterfall hunters uh, that are looking to stay warm, looking to stay dry on those late season hunts when it starts getting cold like this. Um, maybe you're looking to try and hide from the wind a little bit. These jackets are extremely windproof. Uh, they've been tested in some pretty gnarly environments and our testers have had nothing but great things to say about these jackets. So awesome jacket. You're going to see the camouflage pattern goes all the way around the jacket. Um, it features some pretty sweet pockets on the front side of this jacket. Again, the heating elements are going to be placed on the front side. So in the chest on each side here and then kind of across the back here. Awesome jacket. This thing's definitely proved itself over the past year and uh, has been a very popular option for waterfall. And you can see the heating button element is right here on the front left hand side of the chest. Now, maybe you're looking for something that's just a little more stylish, uh, maybe something that you don't necessarily want to wear in the woods, but something that you just want to wear casually. If you're going out for a walk or going out to the grocery store or something like that, um, these jackets are definitely going to be the ones for you. You can definitely wear them hunting. Um, just know the material on the outside is going to be a little louder um, than that of some of the other jackets that we have available here at Tidewee. So this is is our soft shell heated jacket. Um, this is gonna be very similar to some of the other heated jackets that you see out there on the market. Um, again, all of our stuff is priced extremely well. Um, but you can get this jacket right here in this camouflage pattern that you see here. Uh, it is also gonna be available in a black pattern too for those more casual uh, type of wearing opportunities. Um, on the inside of this jacket, you're gonna have kind of like a waffled polar fleece type of material on the inside that's gonna be extremely warm even when the jacket is not being heated. Um, again, you're gonna have heating elements on both sides of the chest and then kind of across the back section here too as well. Just another very popular choice and uh, great jacket to keep you warm in the winter time. 
All right, I do have one more jacket here to talk about. Uh, this is actually a brand new product here from Tidewee 2. We actually just released this about, about a month ago or a month and a half ago or something like that. This is actually the Inferno heated jacket that we just released. Uh, the cool thing about this jacket is it's basically strictly meant for hunting. Now you could wear this for other activities, but as you can tell, we feature an awesome next camouflage pattern on this one. And uh, this jacket is basically gonna be a fleece material on the outside, keeping this jacket extremely extremely quiet um, when you're out in the woods, bow hunting, maybe gun hunting, a very popular option here. Uh, the cool thing about this jacket that we went ahead and did is we actually made a heated seat that is actually built right into the jacket. So if we unzip both sides here, uh, you'll see it'll kind of unfold a seat. And basically when that is folded down, uh, before you go down to sit on your tree stand, uh, you can sit on that pad and that pad is actually gonna be heated from the battery that you plug in to the jacket. So not only are you heating your, your lower back here um, and then the two front sides of your chest, you're also getting a nice little foldable heated seat along with this jacket to sit on um, to make sure you're staying warm out there in the woods. Again, this jacket does have a hood. However, this one is not removable but it is a very solid option for those late season hunts. If you're looking to stay warm, uh, the heated elements in this jacket will definitely do that. Last item that I'm going to talk to you guys about today uh, before we go ahead and end this video is the Tidewee heated waders. Many of you might not know that, uh, but we actually have a 1200 gram breathable pair of insulated waders um, that are heated. And then we also have an 800 gram pair of neoprene waders that are also heated. Uh, basically the neoprene heated waders just feature a, a heated hand muff on the inside of the waders that is fleece lined um, that have month is really just going to keep your hands warm. Our heated breathable waders here actually have a heating element in the back and they also have heating elements that kind of go down your thighs just a little bit. And basically what we did with the breathable waders is created a heated removable liner. So the liner inside of these waders can actually be completely removed. Um, maybe in the summertime if you're not needing that insulation, um, you're not needing those heated elements, you can pull those out if need be and then just wear the breathable pair of waders as they are. Heating element buttons for these waders are actually going to be on the inside of the waders for obvious reasons. Just another awesome pair of waders here from Tidewee. Again, these are heated. You can get them in the breathable version like this one, and then you can also get them in a neoprene version as well. So overall, again, we have a ton of awesome heated products here at Tidewee. We got some new stuff coming down the line even uh, for next year that we're super excited about and that we know that you guys are going to be super excited about as well. So if you're looking for some solid heated clothing, some dependable stuff that you can trust, uh, we got a one-year warranty on all the products that you purchase here from Tidewee. Um, you can head on over to our website, www.tidewee.com. You can check out our heated clothing lineup there. You definitely won't be disappointed. We've got a ton of popular items uh, that will help keep you warm on these really cold days. We just want to make sure you're getting maximum comfort, whether you're out hunting for the day, hiking, um, just walking around in general, or maybe even fishing. Uh, we want to keep you out there longer. So check out our heated clothing. You won't be disappointed. The stuff's awesome. And and uh, it's definitely keeping me warm as we speak. Hopefully you guys all had a great hunting season. Uh, we look forward to seeing you guys on the next video. So be sure to hit that subscribe button. Again, my name is Cody and we'll catch you guys on the next one.